Hi guys, welcome back. So today we're going to introduce you to a new service that we just started offering and we're going to show you it on this 8P RS3. Before we jump into it, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell so then you won't miss if our new videos go live. So we're introducing you to the injector cleaning services today. Obviously injector cleaning, um, having injectors um, that aren't clean um, or sort of like blocked up or going to fail can cause all kinds of issues with direct injection, high performance cars such as the 8P RS3 that can run into many different issues like poor fuel economy, poor idling, um, different amounts of fuels in the cylinder and ultimately can also lead to catastrophic engine failure. So we're gonna show you how we take some dirty injectors and clean them so they're just as good as new. So um, next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go into the workshop and show you the standard injectors from this car, show you what some clean injectors are and then also show the injectors after the cleaning process. So see you inside. Okay, so you've just seen us remove the injectors from the 8P RS3, um, and as you saw, they're pretty badly coked up, and we're gonna be taking it from something looking like this to looking like this. And what happens over time on these injectors, as you can see, is the carbon builds up. And this can happen due to things like incomplete combustion, um, gases being breathed through the intake system, settling on um, these injectors. And what the um, carbon buildup does is it causes the fuel to poorly atomize when it's coming out of the injector into the cylinder. And that causes all kinds of different issues. Um, that can include like misfires, um, bad emissions, because obviously the fuel's not atomizing properly, bad fuel efficiency, um, all kinds of um, negative things like poor running issues, stuff like that. Um, and also these injectors suffer from other issues as well, which you can't really see on the outside, which is to do with leaking. So you can have like leaky um, baskets and you can also have seals as well that have failed. So a few different issues that can, um, from sort of like the lower end of like the driving experience cause like running issues like poor idle, bad fuel efficiency to ultimately um, engine failure as well if you have a big difference of um, fuel volume going in from cylinder to cylinder. Um, so what we um, have is we have this as new fuel injector cleaning machine. And what it basically allows us to do is we put the factory injectors into this injector machine it runs a test so you can see exactly what the uh, volume of fuel flow is. After we've done this, we then put it in a ultrasonic cleaner here. So we put all the tips in the ultrasonic cleaner, clean it out. So we get this going from something like that to something like this. And then what we'll do is we'll put it back in the injector machine. We'll test it again, make sure everything's balanced. And at the same time, we'll also upgrade the filter baskets from a plastic item to a stainless steel item which you can see here so the benefits of the stainless steel item is they're much more robust because this like red plastic gauze can basically burst on the factory injectors and it causes sort of like the leaky injectors and obviously um, other debris to go out into the injector as well which is obviously you don't want and it's going to block it up so we upgrade that um, replace the teflon seal which is like a little white ring at the bottom of the injector and also the top seal as well so after this cleaning process we'll show you what these uh, very dirty injectors look like afterwards and let us know what you think.
Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then please give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to watch other videos of ours that YouTube thinks you'll like, then click up here. If you'd like to watch some other videos that we have in the same playlist, then click here. And obviously, if you enjoyed the video, then we'd really appreciate it if you gave us a subscription. Um, and then obviously, you'll be updated when other videos of ours go live. And you can do that quite easily by clicking here. Hope to see you soon.